Uh, and we can also see some uh, friction uh, bronchoactasis. Uh, this may uh, may be indicated the uh, infection, secondary organizing pneumonia, and the fibr fibrosis formation. Between the boss of the uh, National uh, Society. The whole society name is the Chinese Society of Radiology. Dr. Jin, Dr. Jin, can you see the image? Yes. Okay, you can continue, please. Can you switch to the next screen? Can you see PMC? PMC, PMC. This connection is part and parcel of uh, nourishing on the disease and ensuring that um, we do not uh, make mistakes. Uh, we are very happy with uh, what the doctors in uh, Wuhan are assisting us. You have gone through a tremendously bad time. And uh, that experience that you have, if shared with the rest of the world, can be impactful in, um, in reducing the impact. We are also grateful to uh, Nuvers for the technology that uh, we are seeing here today. This is a game changer. It will be very, very helpful. This disease is uh, global in nature. And therefore, the solution to the disease is also global in nature. And the advice that you are giving us uh, from uh, Wuhan is the advice we are giving our people. We are telling them to, to, to observe very serious hygiene levels. We are saying that everybody in Kenya, in Africa, and indeed the world, must uh, play their part in ensuring that we can save as many people as possible. We send our condolences as a country to all those in the rest of the world who have, uh, who have passed on because of this disease. And we pray that uh, going forward, because of exchange of technology, because of exchange of ideas, because of exchange of the available medicines and care, we will be able to uh, mitigate and minimize the level of death across the world. Let us just make this a new era of cooperation in the medical world, in the medical arena. We will, as a nation, cooperate with other countries to share whatever we have. And we hope that it will be the same. In so doing, uh, we, the human race, can uh, move to another level of cooperation and understand we all live in the world. It's a small place. Nobody is too big and nobody is too small. Through this technology, you have seen for yourselves what is possible. These things were initially just dreams. But today, we have seen reality. And uh, through this kind of cooperation and new other technologies that we are going to roll out in time, we can see how we can utilize the resources we have a lot more efficiently. Today, we saw the, 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 how the scans can be read by individuals, by all 10 or so individuals across the world. And uh, it is not therefore, it is therefore within the realms of our imagination that very quickly we are going to have major operations being done in Kenya by our own doctors, cooperating with doctors in India, in Wuhan, in the United States and Britain and elsewhere, where the travel, where those who have been traveling to overseas countries for care can actually be done here. We can bring the doctors to the screen rather than take the patient overseas. This is what technology can do for us.